Thanks for joining us. I'm Richard Ransom. First at 10, new numbers tonight from the Memphis PD show the stolen car crisis is out of control in Memphis. We're about halfway through the year and more than 7,000 cars reported stolen. That's more than 43 cars every single day and twice last year's rate. Tonight, Zaria Oates is digging deeper into the numbers, showing us how each stolen car is affecting people's lives. 7,420 vehicles stolen and thousands of other cars broken into as thieves shatter windows to steal anything they can get. Jasmine's car was broken into just before 5 a.m. Monday morning. She only noticed as she tried to leave for work. I found that my window is broken. I looked to make sure like a tree didn't fall into it, anything like that. No brick inside, someone broke into my car. I had some family in the house and yeah, she saw two guys. Um, it was pretty dark. She believes they took advantage of power outages, stealing a tablet, a pair of shoes, and a pair of eyeglasses from her car. Now it's impacting her work week. I work Monday through Friday, so it's hard and it's an inconvenience to have to stop out of my busy day and then have something like this replaced. Luckily, Jasmine has insurance and they're working with her to fix the damage, but it's still not something she wants to deal with. I'm young and I'm hardworking and this should not be an issue, especially coming into my own yard to try and steal my vehicle that I worked hard from. With this year doubling the number of stolen cars the Memphis Police Department responded to in 2022, Memphians are left wondering if they're next. So MPD is reminding people almost weekly to lock your car, park in well-lit areas, and invest in a steering wheel lock, car alarm, and tracking device. And if your car has been broken into or stolen, report the incident to Memphis Police Department immediately. In Memphis, I'm Zaria Oates.